unraveling the word late more than just timing. Hello language enthusiasts. Today, we're diving deep into a simple yet versatile word, late. While you might associate it primarily with time, there's more to it than meets the eye. Let's explore the various shades of meaning it carries. When we think of the word, late, our first thought often goes to time. It indicates a delay or something happening after the expected or usual time. For example, I'm late for work. I didn't arrive at the expected time. The train is late. The train didn't arrive on schedule. Late can also denote the latter part or near the end of something. This usage can be less common, but it's still essential to know. For example, in the late afternoon, the sky turned orange. She started her career in her late 20s. In some contexts, particularly when talking about people, late can mean someone who has passed away. It's a more formal and respectful way to refer to someone who's no longer with us. Examples include, her late husband was a renowned doctor. The company was founded by the late Mr. Johnson. Sometimes, late is used to talk about recent events or recent times implying that it's close to the present but not quite now. Examples, the late news reported a rise in stock prices. She's been very active in the late discussions at the forum. This versatile word also pops up in various expressions. Better late than never. It's better to do something late than not to do it at all. Late bloomer, Someone who develops skills, abilities, or interests later than usual. And that wraps up our deep dive into the word, late. Whether it's about time, sequence, or someone's status, it's clear that, late, wears many hats in the English language. We hope this video has illuminated the nuances of this seemingly simple word. Until next time, keep learning and stay curious.